Well, let's take a look make room for the new beginning on its way to you now okay let's see what's coming up here oh there you go so we've got the eight of pentacles what else does virgo you've got justice all your hard work virgo is paying off by letting go yep and you're getting that love offer coming in just let go let go of all the negative Hold on to all the positive. There's definitely a new beginning coming to you. And it's definitely in love. The Justice card tells me that it, things are in your favor. All your effort and work that you've been putting in to yourself. Making your life better. Having a kind of a shift in your, your attitude. And being happier to the best that you can. Just making that decision to be happier is what's gonna draw love into you. So there's definitely gonna be a love offer. You've got the lovers, you have the King of Cups, and you have the Knight of Wands. There is hope and renewal. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> it's like spirits like, oh no, don't even, don't even give them that because they're gonna just be like, wow, this is too good to be true. Uh, Gemini energy there, Aquarius. Uh, King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. I definitely, there's so much passion here with the Knight of Wands. I definitely feel like letting go is what's going to bring you happiness, joy. Um, I always like to say two heads are better than one, right? Um, love, long term, deep partnership, deep love, possibly with a water sign, or it could be those other signs that I said. Yeah, so there's a decision getting made. And I feel like it's two people making the decision to be together. But there's a very strong, passionate connection between these two people. Let's see. Like, it's very lusty. There's physical. Oh, yeah. There you go. There's the devil. It's like a strong physical attraction between two people. It's like crazy. Let's see. Like, obsessive even to the point where it's like when you guys are together, it's not just like simple fireworks. It's like nuclear warfare. The two of you. Like, it's off the charts. Physical type of energy here but there's love involved too you know can't get in like the love is like free but the physical together is like just can't get enough of each other i don't know we're going down that road and i haven't even done my only fans yet my gosh for you guys who are members of my only fans channel please forgive me i will get a reading up to you tomorrow i do promise okay yeah letting go of i feel um somebody new coming in here which is they are showing me a king of cups so it could be a cancer scorpio pisces um if you are single you don't have anybody this person shows up by you letting go and just letting things evolve the way they're meant to um and if you already have a connection i know like divinely guided has a connection with a scorpio yes i gave you a shout out could be a capricorn um there is an energy of like a whole new shift in the person okay with the king of cups a whole new shift and a change deep feelings positive all right let's see what else does virgo need to know look the fool there's a free energy free yourself free yourself the communication comes in there's passion here so much passion starting this new journey together for those of you who don't have anyone this person comes in looking out at the horizon and all the potential where things could go um having visions making plans together i mean it's so nice like super nice it's super positive if you don't like positive readings feel free to click off Nothing wrong with some positive readings. Let me see. Oh, look at this. All the wands. There's going to be a lot of communication. It could be a Sag. There's going to be a lot of communication. Cupid's arrows. Fast, quick messages back and forth. I mean, it's so... It's like passion, 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 excitement, excitement, excitement. Let me see if I can find Chinese sign for you and this person. Let's see what shows up here. Oh, this one's already out, out the gate. We've got the monkey, year of the dragon, year of the rooster, year of the horse. There's a monkey again, double monkeys, double horse, year of the snake, 
Year of the Ox, Rooster again, Double Rooster, Year of the Rat, and Year of the Tiger. So that could be you, it could be this person. Let's take a look and see what Zodiac sign might be showing up here. Cancer, Cancer, Aquarius. I hope I shuffle these enough. Aquarius, Gemini, Aries. What sign did I not say? Goodness. Leo, Gemini, Virgo. Okay. All right, let's see what numbers and initials we can get for this person. Their name may start with an A, may start with an E, may start with a D. Um, I'm just hearing somebody might be like a paramedic or in the military. I guess you can be both, right? Um, someone's born in 73. Someone may be 37 years of age. This person, okay. Someone's birthday is on the 18th. Um, someone may be 53. You are this person, actually. We're also getting the seventh. Someone's born in 1960. And let's get, oh, they just said give you September birthday. September 3rd. Okay. Let's get a charm. Another charm for you. Oh, you've got a sunflower. Beautiful. That makes me feel like Leo energy. It also gives me like summer summertime and the living is easy so yeah sunflower if somebody likes sunflowers very much or loves sunflowers just really into the sunflower thing i just want to get some oracle messages as well because i didn't i didn't grab them or other messages of love oracle message for virgo now just remember you guys if you're listening to the full one hour reading these could all blend okay these past uh the past messages if you're just clicking on and listening to the 15 minute then go back and listen to the others because they can all be kind of feeding off each other acceptance everything happens for a reason wow virgo that's your message accept things and that might relate to the um the first reading as well but it, uh, the no but it can also be letting go and just letting things evolve okay yeah someone feels remorse for the way they treated you a little bit of regret showing up here let me see you also have fate this here is a destined partnership um denial detach with love to clearly see the truth some of you might actually be denying this relationship or this love because it's too good to be true all the passion and the love but they're saying be patient everything will unfold in divine timing which is temperance sagittarius the person in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson so it could be you teaching them a lesson spiritually or you learning a spiritual lesson from this person which is a beautiful thing and i feel like the spiritual lesson for you is about loving yourself accepting yourself virgo that's the best gift you can give to yourself is to just be like you know what not perfect but i am pretty cool like i am not perfect but i'm good enough okay healing old childhood wounds and child old wounds childhood issues need revisiting and need to be healed so let go let things evolve i feel like that's the strongest message here for you and yeah i'm gonna leave that there come back tomorrow and there will be a whole new slew of messages all right you guys don't forget click like share and subscribe and do 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 book a personal reading with me text reading or a phone call either one all right you guys i will see you all back here tomorrow bye hey you guys thank you so much for watching my readings if you'd like to get a personal reading please feel free to click the link in the description box below to go ahead and follow that link and book your reading please remember to book subscribe like do all the great things um and i hope that you guys have a fantastic blessed loving and light filled life